So this is a dynamic release for your lats using a foam roller. This technique is very good for stretching off your lats and in particular treating uh, trigger points within them. Common trigger point you'll find in your lat is just at the inferior angle of your scapula to the bottom part of your shoulder blade, which is seated just under here. But if you feel around the back of feel onto your shoulder blade and follow it down, it comes to a natural point at the end and just below that it's quite a common trigger point. But I'll show you how we do it. So I'm going to go into a sideline position. I'm going to have the roller under my arm. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hand like a fist and put it in the crook of my neck, just so I've got my neck so it's something to, to rest on, so I'm not trying to hold my head up and stress my neck. Okay, I'm, I'm slightly back. So I'm not on the side of my ribs, I'm just slightly back, trying to get as much of the lats as I can. And then I can just roll onto it and I'm feeling for a point of discomfort. Well, what I can do is just start at the bottom angle, relax my head, and now what I'm going to do is bring my arm up so it's in line with my ear, so I've swept along, and then lift up to the ear and then release it down. And what I'm doing is I'm, you, I can roll up a bit then, lock down with my body weight to create a lock on the muscle and then arm along like this and then up to my ear. And then release that and I can move up a little bit further and repeat that process again. So a long, so it's like a sweep coming up and then up to my ear. Now, if I'm doing this and I find a point which is particularly tender, so let's say at the start, it was quite tender, just as I was on here, okay, which it is, what I'd do is I'd move slightly down, okay? So I'm just off that point. So the point where it was quite painful is now this side of the roller, okay? And then, I'm going to perform two to three of these sweeps along like this. Okay. And the way we sort of do it is stretch, lock, no, lock, stretch, one, two, and then release. So the lock is the body weight down onto the roller. The stretch is bringing the arm sweeping up and then up to the ear. And then one, two, and then release by bringing the body weight off and bringing the arm out. If you do two or three on that, you'll find that that point will start to be broken up. The reason, so imagine this is the painful point. So we come onto the roller like that. If we stayed on the point, as we bring the arm up and away, we've come off, the points come off. If we put this painful point just before the roller, as we bring the arm up, and up to our ear, we're dragging that dysfunctional tissue onto the roller and stretching it through the roller rather than skipping off it the other side. So that's why wherever the, the pain is, you put it the opposite side of the stretch you're performing. But have a play with it. It's a very good way of treating your lats. And if you do have a problem there, it can be quite tender, but two or three of those actions are really gonna release the muscle.